I just love doing things that have never been done before. Helium cluster balloons are a balloon system that's composed of generally latex balloons, large latex balloons flown in a, uh, in a bunch or a cluster. I've just always enjoyed flight and things that fly. And we decided that we wanted to do a project together. We tried coming up with something that made sense in the air. A flying octopus is certainly unique and unusual, and we know it's going to get attention. But I was thinking more structurally, it would be um, a much more balanced sculpture. It would be you know, somewhat easier to predict what it will do. Larry Moss then flushed out a team to build his vision. But again, I've never done anything this big. So as far as the structural integrity and everything, I'm just kind of going on their word, but you know, I've seen what they've done before and it's some mighty impressive stuff, so I think everything's going to go well. Tasks were divided among the team and the construction took on assembly line efficiency. Work often continued well after nightfall, when the illuminated sculpture would almost glow in the darkness. The artists got an opportunity to showcase their skill by creating detailed sculptures to adorn the outside of the octopus. Uh, you, you need to uh, move her seashells. They're uh, too deep for the breasts. You know why she has seashells, right? She's by the seashells. No, because these shells are too big. <laughs> Except for the funny part. We just leave that out and save the trouble. The transportation of the octopus pieces to the launch site was done with an octopus parade using volunteers from the community. Octopus parade! To add lift, helium balloons were inflated inside the head of the sculpture. After inspection and damage repair, the 45-foot-long tentacles were secured to the octopus head. Following the tentacles, the detail pieces were attached to the sculpture. The lift needed to raise a sculpture, pilot, and ballast would require about 10,000 cubic feet of helium. The helium would be contained in 72 5-foot and 7-foot latex balloons. About an hour would be spent to inflate and secure the balloons. The crowd that had gathered for the spectacle anxiously awaited to see if the octopus would fly. 